Hi, welcome to my review of the Bosch Max 6 model number WAE24067 GB 27. Um, which is uh, a few years old now, but um, my auntie has this one, uh, this particular model. Um, used to be her full time machine, but uh, she moved, they moved out. Of that house, and then the, the, the house that he was in, they are now actually renting out the house via uh, Airbnb. Anyway, they've now got a Bosch WAQ283 uh, off me, which there's already a review of. So if you want to see that review, it's down there, which is another model. But anyway, apart from repairing the door lock, which I repaired. Um, because you overload it with cushions, these machines are pretty much uh, sturdy machines. Now, obviously, quality-wise, compared to, say, 20 years ago, it's nothing like a 20-year-old washer. But, in comparison to everything else on the market, these are pretty solid washers, and they're not that expensive. Um, being a Max, it's basically Bosch's basic range, but where there's a bit of a, 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 a ride, there's a, it's a bit weird on who actually makes them. You see, Bosch have two factories. They have the Bosch factory and they have the Bailey factory in Spain. Uh, now the Bailey factory tends to sort of do the cheaper models, like the Max, but this one really isn't really a Bailey machine. Um, no, it's a Bosch Classics. No, really, it's just a Bosch Classics, but with a slightly different fascia on the front, so it's, well, you know, it's basic. So, at the top, we have a very, very basic um, amount of programs and options. We actually get just, uh, well, we get 15 programs, and that's it. Ready? So, we've got Cotton 20, Cotton 30, Cotton 40. Cotton Eco 40, Cotton 60, Cotton Eco 60, and Cotton, Eco, uh, Cotton 90. We have two options here. We have the Express Wash, which will lower the uh, cycle times by, well, a lot. So let me just put it this way. Basically, the normal cotton cycles are around two and a half hours. But with Express Wash, cuts it down to around an hour, depending on what temperature you select. We have a rinse plus option. This will add on the rinse, and if it's anything like the Aqua Plus, it will also up the rinse, uh, the rinse and wash level as well of the water. Uh, and this is actually available for with the Express Wash too, so you can have an Express Wash with an extra rinse. And that's also altered in the same sense. It's still an express wash rinse, which is pretty good. Uh, the only thing with express wash with the logic that I had was the fact that it has a short spin, but not in this case. I've seen to have uh, washed some stuff with express wash, and the final spin's exactly the same. So you don't actually lose your spinning ability. Rinsing ability seems to be exactly the same with express wash. Um, and obviously washing ability, obviously if it's anything other than light soiled, it's not going to do a very good job. But because everything you wear is generally light soiled, it should be okay uh, for everyday wear. Uh, like I said, cycle times are about 3 hours. Cotton standard 60 and cotton standard 40 are the longest cycles, but weirdly, express wash is still there. I haven't tested this out yet, and I am going to because it seems a bit unusual to have the Express Wash still available with the Eco 60 and 40 programs. Well, at least, at least in this uh, age of Bosch. Uh, right, we've also got a Rinse and Spin program, which of course you can Rinse Plus on that. You've got a Spin Only program, which um, does a 1200 spin, and just to also um, tell you that the max spin on this is also 1200 RPM. Obviously a drain out program, where you want to drain the wash water out. A mix load 30 degree program, now this is pretty quick, it's 3 quarters of an hour. And you can have express wash with it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we've got a wool program which is about 40 minutes long. Delicates which is also around 40 minutes long. 
uh, Easy Care 40 and 30. Now these are about an hour 40, an hour 50 on the normal cycles, but with Express Wash it's down to an hour. Again, Express Wash is also available on Delicates and on Wall and on Mixed Load. It's basically available on everything apart from the three cycles at the bottom. Although that's uh, weird, the Express Wash is available here on the Wall because uh, on the logics I used to have, it wasn't available. So considering it's already 40 minutes long on wool, how long is it going to be with its fresh wash? Rather interesting. Um, and that's it really, that's all you get. But for an everyday person, maybe living on your own, maybe living as a couple, it's going to wash your normal clothes. There's no special cycles on there other than the mixed load cycle, but why would you? Like I said, though, there's no. Uh, there's also. There's also, if you notice, no uh, separate quick wash programs like a super quick, uh, fifteen minute program. Um, that's because they want you to buy the upper model. Um, but even so, uh, mixed load at thirty degrees with splash wash is around three quarters of an hour. So, right budget, and then the cotton or easy care cycles are down to an hour with that splash wash. Right, another little thing you need to know. This machine has a load sensor and it just up to about four different levels. That so much, it's uh, on the Cotton 90, it can drop um, the express wash time anyway. I've just done it with a small load in just 65 minutes. But with a full load, it'll take about an hour 30 to an hour 40. Which isn't bad, that's actually pretty quick. I just love the fact that even with Express Wash, the load sensor still is switched on and still adjusts. It's pretty cool. Right, so the door is a Bosch Classics door. No getting away from that. We've also got a Bosch Classics seal there. We've also got a Bosch Classics drill with the metal pad in. There's no going that way. This is actually just a Bosch Classics for much, much cheaper. At the bottom there, apart from the scrape of whatever's been going across there, which is usually a vacuum cleaner, um, we've got a filter flap here to get out your filter, including um, a drain hose still, which is rather impressive since cheaper models uh, from cheap on other brands tend to omit that because it's a, another expense. Really, really impressive. Right, so we're all loaded up with these few bits. We've got a dressing gown. This, I don't know. For some reason they were sat in a bag, and for some reason they were still wet weeks later. So just to test out how quick it really is, we're going to select mix wash, load even with the express wash. Uh, right, another thing here, we've got three LEDs. Um, we've got ready, wash, rinse, spin and end. And by the end, in the ready lights, there is no LED. This is partly to save money. Uh, but what they do instead, is rather than having an LED, this, the wash light will flash to say that the machine is ready to use, to start a cycle. Then, once you start, that wash light will go solid. You'll move on to the rinse. Move on to the spin, solid, and then at the end of the cycle, once the door has unlocked, the uh, spin um, icon will then flash, which will mean end. And it will continue to flash until you reset the cycle, which you can all just do simply by, just by turning the dial back and back to the program you want. Or indeed, you can just turn it off. Alright, so in our design drawer we have three compartments. This drawer is no different to the other Siemens and uh, Bosch's that I've had in the past. So we have a 400mm uh, main wash, a 200mm pre wash, and a 200mm uh, fabric softener compartment, which in today's terms is rather unnecessary. I mean, look, that's a normal dose of comfort in tents, and yeah, you know, just made a dent in it. And then we've got about 50ml of some uh, personal colour, so that can go in there, that's going to go in the main wash. And this pre-wash section, you'll never have to use. There's no pre-wash option on this. 
Actually, I was generally surprised because generally the uh, generally Bosch put a um, one D cotton cycles with a uh, pre wash. Right, you may have also noticed that the start light also flashes along with the wash light. When you press start, both the wash light goes solid.
That's loud then. That's dry. That smells nice. Light it dry. Good. I'm passing this there a mess, but uh, no. Cool. Well done. Right. Now, I won't give this out of 10. I'm going to give this 9 out of 10. Simply as. To put it, well, it's cheap, it's reliable, it's very basic, uh, and the motor isn't exactly what you call quiet, but then again, there are a lot of uh, manufacturers out there. So yeah, it's a good little machine, good little all-rounder, and I recommend for like one to two people. Family-wise, maybe a different machine, or if you're wanting more flexibility, look elsewhere. But even so, the express wash function and the rinse plus, what else do you need? How often do you use a pre-wash? How often do you use reduced ironing? You don't! And it will save you money on every wash load by simply calculating how much it needs to use, and by reducing the time. It's a, it's a good little package, that's for sure. Alright, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you again soon.